Hello, my name is Herman. This video is the fourth in a series of 16 videos about narcissistic abuse in a relationship. In this video, we will discuss a specific characteristic of a narcissist. This particular trait is crucial because it allows early recognition that you are in a toxic relationship. In the beginning, a narcissistic partner can be overwhelming. They shower you with gifts and appear very interested, constantly calling, expressing quick and intense affection. For instance, they might try to convince you to open a joint account, ask for a key to your house, or even bring up marriage quickly. Building trust and love usually takes time for most people, but for narcissists, this process seems to happen much faster. They are generally quick to engage in sexual activities, a pattern that applies to both male and female narcissists. The question to ask yourself is whether this behavior is normal and how frequently they engage in it. How often do men find themselves seduced by a woman in such a manner? We often feel flattered when a woman shows quick attraction and interest in us. However, this is precisely what should raise concerns. If you are not as eager to move fast, there's a good chance they will manipulate you. They might claim you don't care enough about them, bringing up examples of previous partners who were willing to open joint accounts. In such situations, a man tends to rationalize what's happening, giving the narcissist time and space to come up with an apology for their rapid and extravagant behavior. However, this apology is hollow. This tactic is designed to keep you in the relationship for as long as possible, with the goal of coercing you into doing what they want. In the eyes of the narcissist, this is the perfect relationship, one where you completely sacrifice your needs to serve your narcissistic partner. For a narcissist, you are just a tool. No matter how many tears they shed to manipulate you, they see you as an object they can control and use. And they can play this game with multiple men simultaneously. Remember, narcissists can easily and quickly form new relationships and maintain multiple partners simultaneously. These relationships have no deep meaning for narcissists. All they want to know is who will go along with their plan of a quick commitment and accept the abuse. The way they manipulate their partner and have multiple relationships simultaneously is incredible. And all of this without any remorse. I say incredible because most men have no idea that there are multiple men in the picture. Narcissists possess incredible acting skills. They will present themselves as respectable women, and you won't suspect such behavior. In the beginning, they figure out what type you are attracted to, then do their best to play that type. They tell you what you want to hear and pretend to share the same interests to deceive you and make you fall in love with them. Their ultimate goal is to entangle you in their web of abuse. The fact that they quickly get into bed with you, constantly call you, want to know everything about you but reveal little about themselves should set off alarm bells. A narcissist tries hard to hide negative behavior in the beginning. However, sometimes, they make mistakes early on. You might notice signs like not being genuinely grateful for the gifts you buy them. For a narcissistic partner, you are not unique. As quickly as they seem to fall in love with you, that's how quickly the love is over. Then, they move on to the next victim they already have lined up. So, be very alert to someone who wants to open a joint account quickly, wants to live together after a few months, or talks about marriage soon. There's nothing wrong with a kind, nice, and attentive woman. But when she shows impulsive behavior, coupled with hidden negative behavior like ingratitude, there's a chance you're in the early stages of a relationship with a narcissist. The safest way to exit such a relationship is with an excuse. For example, Say you don't feel the same way about her as she does about you. Confrontation will only lead to arguments, and she will seek revenge. By making up an excuse, she will feel superior to you, giving her a good feeling about herself, and she will leave you alone. In part 5, we will discuss a very serious consequence of narcissistic abuse, suicidal thoughts by the victims. If you don't want to miss this video, subscribe to this channel and also click on the notification bell. Read articles on the website www.unmaskingnarcissism.com. Additionally, you can download a free ebook with 10 tips for recovery after narcissistic abuse. Thank you for watching this video, and see you next time.